Hi ladies and gentlemen, this is Tony Hollowitz, and I want to, in this tutorial, just start addressing some of the things that are different between ACT in the cloud and ACT on the desktop. Now for those of you that have never used the desktop, some of this information might not even be worth taking the time to watch. I think if you've used the desktop version for years and years, and I know many of you have, then some of these comparisons will be helpful. It is my feeling that 80% of the things we do with the software is virtually the same, but there are subtle differences because you're going from desktop software to web-based software. So on the left-hand side of my screen, I have shrunken down just the navigation bar of ACT on the desktop. Again, that's on the left-hand side of the screen. On the right-hand side is the ACT web version. So this is the ACT cloud. Now, a couple things you'll notice. One, these items here in ACT Desktop are down below. The font is a little bit different than the font here. The search box or search area in the desktop version is up top. On the web version, it's down below. Very subtle differences. The biggest difference here is these items. And I got to tell you, of all these items, I never use these. These are things they added into the ACT Desktop version that as a long time user, it's like I'm almost blind to those. I don't even see them. So the most drastic difference is that they flipped top and bottom. These items are on the top in the web, bottom desktop, and vice versa. That's really the only major difference between the two. So ladies and gentlemen, this is short. This is just about the navigation bar. In the next tutorial, we're going to talk about the menus across the top in some of the icons so you can see a comparison of that. Thank you so very much. Have a great day. Bye now.